In this video, we're gonna be taking a look at this laptop stand. It is Lamacaw's latest laptop riser stand, model number LN01. My name is Adrian, and on this channel, I provide product reviews. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. In the interest of full disclosure, Lamacaw did send this stand out free of charge for me to review. However, that's not gonna have any bearing on my opinions and the overall review of this product. Finding solutions to help you bring your laptop device to a perfect viewing angle is something that most of us are looking for if you're working from home or if you work on your laptop for long periods of time. Once you do have your laptop at the perfect viewing angle, that's going to help with ergonomics and just overall comfort. The LN01 comes in silver, which the one that we're reviewing today is the silver version, and it also comes in gray. This laptop stand is made of very thick aluminum alloy. This laptop stand features a rubber silicone that runs all the way from the top, wraps around the back, and is featured here at the bottom as well. It's, an, it's a feature that's meant for anti-slip. So once you place your laptop on top, it's gonna hold it in place, and the uh, laptop stand at the bottom, being that it has a rubber piece at the bottom, will also hold the laptop stand in place. This laptop stand also features this V shape to help with air circulation to keep your laptop cool. It's compatible with laptops up to 17 inches and it weighs 3.23 pounds. There's really no setup with this laptop stand. There's nothing to adjust. You just simply place the laptop stand where you need it and place your laptop right on top of it and you're good to go. It's gonna hold it right in place. It's gonna prevent uh, your laptop from sliding around being that it does have that rubber piece at the bottom. It has that rubber lining up on top as well. So it's gonna prevent your laptop from sliding off uh, if it were, if there was any type of vibration on your desktop. And as you can see, once you place this laptop or once you place your laptop on the stand, you can see that it brings it to the perfect viewing angle. So the difference here is if you were to work on your laptop on your desktop like this, typically this is the angle you would be looking at. And as you can tell, uh, my neck is bent a little bit. My head is uh, angled downward to be able to see the screen on my laptop, which after a while, that's gonna cause a little bit of strain on your neck there. But if we were to put this laptop on the laptop stand, now it brings the screen to eye level. So I'm no longer having to bend my neck down to be able to look at the screen on my laptop. Now it's at eye level, which means that over a long period of time of using my laptop, it's now gonna take the strain off of my neck and it will make for a more comfortable viewing angle for uh, long sessions. And being that the, um, the bottom of this laptop stand has this nice little lip here, when you place your external keyboard here, it'll match up real nicely. I'm gonna grab mine here real quick. So I have my Apple keyboard here, and as you can tell, I can butt this up to the laptop stand and it matches very nicely being that my keyboard is silver and the laptop stand is silver as well. So if you do have one of those magic keyboards that are uh, that space gray color, you can opt to get the gray colored laptop stand and it'll match very nicely. So being that this laptop stand is silver, my keyboard is silver, everything matches real nice here. And as you can tell, it butts up very nicely and I can use now use my laptop for a long session and not have to worry about that neck strain that you normally get when you use your laptop on a desktop. A useful feature of this stand is this real nice cutout at the back of the stand here. What this will help you with is organizing your cables. So you can take your charging cable and any USB cables that you need to route to the laptop, put them through the hole there, and now you're gonna be able to plug them into your laptop and keep them nicely organized going through the middle of the laptop right here. So it keeps everything real nice and tidy and organized. You also have this real nice surface area that's nice and deep here so that you can take your keyboard once you're done uh, using your laptop and place it underneath. So it keeps everything really nicely organized and tucked away. Next up, we're gonna talk about the pros and cons of this laptop stand, as well as our final thoughts of this device. Before we jump into that section of the video, I'd like to ask that if you found some value in this video so far, please hit that like button, and also consider subscribing if you haven't subscribed already. I first wanna talk about the cons of this laptop stand. To be quite honest, I couldn't find any cons. 
there's nothing to set up there's nothing to adjust so what you get is what you get with this laptop stand and as you were able to see in our demonstration here placing my uh, laptop on top of this stand brings the uh, screen to the perfect viewing angle so that's all you can really ask for out of a laptop stand now in terms of the pros on this stand it is made of very thick aluminum but aside from it being made of thick aluminum which provides for a very sturdy laptop stand it is made very well it's built very well and it's very stylish especially if you do have a macbook pro either in silver or um, space gray uh, the silver of this stand matches very nicely with apple products but even if you have any other uh, branded uh, laptops this laptop is going to work great i really love the fact that it has a cutout here to be able to keep your cabling very organized and out of the way so that you don't have cables coming out of your laptop and heading in every direction. Your cables are gonna tuck nicely right underneath this laptop stand. I also like the fact that you have this real nice large surface here so that you can take your external keyboard and just place it right underneath when you're done using your laptop. Uh, the real nice uh, thick uh, silicone rubber that runs along the top side all the way to the bottom side really does provide an anti-slip uh, feature to this laptop stand which is key if you are placing this stand on top of a, uh, a desktop that is rather slippery or if you do run into those issues where uh, someone might bump into your um, your desk in terms of cooling as we mentioned already i really do like the uh, v-shape here that's going to allow for uh, ventilation to move in and out of this laptop and I'm not uh, there's one other thing that I um, uh, let's see I'm trying to get it on camera here let me unplug these cables so if you notice here on the rubber piece there is a bump here this this little bump right here also adds to the ventilation it's gonna allow air to circulate uh, easily with this stand here so if, as you can tell it provides a little bit of a, a lip there so that it creates a little bit of space between the laptop and the stand to give you a little bit more air circulation on the bottom vents of your laptop so overall i really do like the design of this laptop stand it's very stylish very sleek I love that the uh, aluminum is uh, thick so that it's very sturdy. And as I said, there's nothing to it. There's nothing to set up. Just simply place it on your desktop, place it where you need it, put your laptop right on top, put your keyboard in place, route your cables through the cutout here, and you're good to go. And now for the million dollar question. Is the Lamacall Allen 01 laptop riser stand worth your hard earned money? As of the recording of this review video, this laptop stand sells for $49.99 on Amazon. I think it's well worth the cost of the product. This laptop stand has one job, and that's to hold your laptop at the perfect viewing angle, and it does that perfectly. And at $49.99, I think you're getting a very nice looking product that does its job very well. That's going to complete my review of the Lamacall Allen 01 laptop riser stand. If you found some value in this video, I'd appreciate it if you were to hit that like button. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. That way you get notified the next time we upload a new video. And on that note, I will see you on the next review.